hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video what i'm gonna be is teaching you guys how i get five grow tokens every day a lot of people actually comment on my grow token videos how do you get grow tokens so fast because i make a grow token video how i get 200 grow tokens like every few months and people are surprised how do you get them so fast so in this video i'm gonna explain how i get five grow tokens every day so you can do the same thing if you are trying to get a grow token item so before of doing this video i actually used to get three grow tokens every day which is if you want the cheap option which is you barely have to spend any world locks but you can still get three grow tokens every day or if you don't care about your world locks that much and you can spend a bit more you can get five grow tokens every day so i'm going to show you guys every step how you can get five grow tokens every day so the first thing I do whenever I log on into Gratopia is, of course, I do roles. If you do slash roles, you will see there's a free quest today, which is something a lot of people know. As you can see, today is farmer day, and if you do a farmer quest, you will get one grow token. So I do these kinds of steps every day. And roll quests are actually pretty cheap. As you can see, harvest 15 thousand rarity of any tree so that means i don't have to spend any warlocks i just have to go harvest trees in my farm world as you can see right now i'm in my farm world so now i'm gonna go and harvest trees so i can finish the farming quest and of course this will cost me zero warlock because i already have trees ready so i'm gonna finish this roll quest real quick and i'll be back as you can see, I just completed a farmer quest. So let's redeem my grow token. But before I redeem my grow token, I always wear the jack set and the cape, which is something you don't need to wear if you're just aiming for grow tokens. But I'm just wearing the full set and the, the cape that you need for the quest so I can get more points because I'm trying to get level 10. That's why I have these items, but you don't need them. So as you can see, I can complete the quest and now it says congratulations, we're giving you a grow token. So now today I got one grow token. The next way you can get a second grow token is by doing the daily quest. As you can see, this is today's daily quest. So you go to buy DQ, which is buy daily quest, but in short form, you go here and you see what's the price of daily quest as you can see today's daily quest is six world locks or five world locks so today's daily quest is pretty cheap daily quests can be like any type of price honestly it can be really cheap like it is today or it can be really expensive my limit is i won't pay more than one diamond lock for a daily quest because it's simply not worth it there are daily quests that cost like more than two diamond locks which is too expensive because if you really want grow tokens you can just buy grow tokens like one diamond lock per grow token you can easily just buy grow tokens if you're really rich and you want it right away just do that you don't need those really expensive daily quests so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna buy daily quests as you can see it says sell daily quest 5 this is cheaper i'm gonna trade the guy buy daily quest so now i got this quest for five world locks so today's daily quest cost me five world locks and for a grow token but if you want a higher chance there are things called grow electables i also buy these but you don't need to buy these because if you put grow electables on you there's like a 25 percent chance to get a double grow token 20 yeah here it says 25 percent chance of a double grow token and it's really small chance so you don't need to buy these but i do so it's okay and now i'm gonna turn in and i just got one grow token i didn't get two unfortunately but it's a chance so now i have two grow tokens a third way to get the third grow token is you need to do crazy gyms live quests every day so pretty much as you can see i have two done already because i gave these yesterday usually when i have a really hard quest i just skip them and just try to get an easy quest to do every day so basically i did these and i didn't turn them in so i still have them till this day and you won't lose these quests if you finish them unless you turn it in which is why if let's say i got five gear tokens 
I unfortunately can't get five gear tokens in one day. Like in this video, I can, I'm showing you guys, but some of the gear tokens that I'm getting don't count for this quest. So this quest takes a few days, but I don't mind waiting. So I finished this quest just today and I also delivered the antler hat, which is like one more lock. Yeah, today's quest that I got is catch two thousand lbs of fish realistically i wouldn't do this quest because i'm just lazy i don't want to fish for 2000 lbs but since i am making this video i will do that for you guys to show you guys that you can get growth tokens so yeah i'm just gonna go fish now and i'll be back when i finish this quest so now that i finished catching 2000 uh, lbs of fish i can now turn all of these three and to get a girl token you have to turn all three of them at the same day so you can like do two yesterday and one today no you have to do all three the same day as you can see it says bonus girl token so now i have gotten three girl tokens and now i'm going to show you guys how you get two more girl tokens so of course if you do slash rolls Go to view grow pass you can see all these that will give points to the of course the rewards you don't have to buy it to get the rewards but you can get a girl token if you do get the points so once a month as you can see the, here was a girl token but you can't see that but i did redeem that girl token so you can get one extra girl token if you just get the points and you get points by of course doing all these quests so well, we already finished the daily quest we already finished the roll quest and the life goals so now we need to do daily bonuses if you do all these daily bonuses you will get the mega bonus which is two more grow tokens which is the two grow tokens we do not have so this is how you get them of course i also like to do b weekly quests which are like once one or two weeks and we'll give you some three random quests. I already finished them. But if you do them, you will get 300 grow pass, which is what I do to get points here and get the crates and grow tokens, which is pretty good. So now I'm going to do the daily bonuses to get to two grow tokens. And I'm going to show you guys. So first is gem bonus. Of course, you earn 1250 gems you get more gems i got gems while i was harvesting trees that's why it's finished of course i was fishing to finish the life goals so i already did fishing and now i need to do surgery so i'm going to do surgery real quick so now let's do surgery and if you don't know how to do surgery you don't really need to know surgery you just do ultrasound and of course it doesn't show you and you do lab kit then you see it's a bird flu if you don't know how to do whatever it says, you can just go to Grootopia Wiki and it tells you what tools to use. But since it's a bird flu, I already know how a bird flu works is you just use antibiotics all the time and you'll finish it. See, and now I finished the surgery quest. Now I need to do Gager real quick. So of course I have a Gager here that's ready. So I'm just going to use this one. And of course, if you don't have Gager, that's also okay but it's good to invest in a gager if you want to get like the mega bonus which is two great tokens every day you do want to buy a gager so you could do this every day which a gager right now is maybe like 14 or 15 world locks so it's a good investment to buy so you can get great tokens but other than that pretty much you buy gager once for 15 world locks and that's it you won't need to spend any more world locks plus if you do gager there's a, actually a chance you actually get a good item like a good crystal like a white crystal so actually as you can see i actually didn't get a white crystal or i just got bad items but there's a chance you can get white crystals so you can actually just double your world locks while you're just trying to get the grow tokens so the next step is defeat your first villain so let's do that real quick so of course to defeat a villain i do recommend for you to use a crime wave because that's gonna it's like one world log and it's gonna spawn you like four villains it's much better like you're not really good at defeating villains so if you buy crime wave you will get four villains and one of them villains has a higher chance to be an easy villain while if you're more experienced of course i won't use the crime wave i will just get a henchman i do not recommend buying a henchman 
because it's the same price as a crime wave. I just have henchmans because I got it as a prize of defeating crimes before. So I'm just going to defeat henchman and defeat the quest. And the next one I have is Lobster Bonus. Lobster is actually something I had to actually buy. I didn't have before. But like the smart way is you can buy an underwater sea blast as you can see right here. And I just placed a bunch of lobster traps. But I only like put baits in four just in case if something goes wrong with one. So I just have four and how you can bait them is I buy 200 shining flashy things for one more luck. And you have to remember to put bait every single day. So that's what I do. So I punch once. And it says no catch yet because these aren't ready. And I just realized I actually put all of these baits yesterday. So they aren't ready yet because the baits, they can be ready in two days. So that's why you have to remember I punch one and I restock it. And next day I won't punch this one. I'll punch the next one, you know, same thing in every single day. But unfortunately, while filming this video, I am not ready, so I can't get the lobster. But there's one more way I can actually get the lobster. So one of my friends actually has a lobster world too, and I go here just in case one of my lobsters don't work. But I do recommend is getting your own. So since mine aren't ready yet, I'll just try to use this. But as you can see, I just got one. So it's all good. And let's see the next step. So next one is Wolf Bonus. Double prize for your first Wolf World. So now, of course, I have to do Wolf World. And Wolf World Whistles, you actually have to buy every single day. You can get Wolf Whistles for 15 World Locks, which is from Locky. But usually, resellers will sell them for, of course, higher. So I actually bought this whistle for 16 World Locks because the resellers will sell it for... Like 16 or 17 warlocks trying to make profit back. But yeah, let me do wolf roll real quick and I'll be back. So now we need pet bonus, so let's do that. To do this, you also don't need the most expensive deck. I got this, I, like I literally just googled the cheapest and the best deck that you should buy. I can show you guys my deck, so you guys can copy my deck if you want. This one, and this one. So this is what I was told, it's a good deck. And it's also a cheap deck, so this is what I use to defeat my pet whistle trainers. So now we have two left, cooking and synth. So let's do that. If you don't know how to do that, you need like every chemical in your inventory. As you can see, you have all of them. And you just need this one. There are more of course, but they are more complicated. But if you want to use it easily, you just need this one. So let's start. And how it works is of course I need to get green. So let's see if I see green, I'm just basically pushing the green until here and doing the same thing with every single one. So let's do that. So now as you can see, ultimate bonus two grow tokens and I will show you guys. You go here, you see I finished every daily bonus. So I've also gotten to two grow tokens for earning all daily bonuses. And yeah, this is how you get five growth tokens every day. I can also give you guys some other ways how you can get growth tokens, which you can't do every day, but you can still get growth tokens. How to get growth tokens is once a month, Gertopia will want you to do their survey, which is, it says, here it is, the Gertopia survey for June. Uh, you need to do this on mobile. You have to log on on mobile and do the survey and you will get two grow tokens. This happens once a month. So this is how you can get grow tokens. And of course, I showed you guys in the beginning of the video. And of course, you don't need to buy a grow pass. If you do, as you can see, you'll get three grow tokens. But I didn't buy the grow pass and I got one grow token. 
for free so you just need to collect the points and this is how you also get grow tokens you used to be able to get grow tokens is you get grow tokens in world of the day and there's a grow token in world of the day somewhere in the world and you have to do parkour to get it but for now which i understood it is disabled so you can't do that but maybe later when it's not disabled anymore you can go and do the parkour to get the grow token and at least those are all the ways I know how to get extra grow tokens, which isn't expensive. Of course, if you want grow tokens really badly, you can buy grow tokens for one diamond lock each. And you can buy 200 grow tokens right away. That will cost you two BGLs. But that is not worth it to me. So I do these easy steps. And this is how you can get grow tokens every single day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, be sure to subscribe as well for more videos like this. Spread to like the video so I know you guys enjoy these types of videos. And yeah. Comment down below what you thought of this video. See you guys next time. Goodbye. I'll never